Hi, this is Leah with Pretty Presets for Lightroom, and today I just want to show you how to use the brush tool to effectively and selectively tone down the highlights or the clipped portions of your image. So I'm going to go ahead and just show you really quick what I did to this image to begin with. Go ahead and reset it, and this is what I started with. And then I went ahead and uh, I cropped it just a bit. So we'll pull that up. I used the Bubble Tea preset from the film collection. And then I used the Creamy Center Light from the Enchanted Garden. White Balance Temp Warmth, also, also from Enchanted Garden. I used the Sharpen for Females and Babies, and this is from um, the Clean and Creative collection. And then at this point, now I'm ready to go ahead and adjust my clipping. So over here, this little triangle up here above your histogram, this is your clipping triangle. It shows your highlight clipping. These are the areas that you're losing detail in. If you go ahead and click on it, instead of just hovering over it, it'll keep those red areas selected for you. Now I'm gonna go to my brush tool, and I've already selected my fixed clipping brush. This is in the basics brushes. And then I wanna go down here. I'm using um, a 100, 100 flow, and it's really important that you click the auto mask. If you don't have the auto mask selected, then any adjustments you make will fall outside of the red area. And I don't want that. I just wanna adjust the red area. So once you have these things selected, you can just go over here and you just, whoop, look at that. You just click on the red sections just like so, and it just fixes the clipping in just those areas that you um, selected. And I pretty much only care about the clipping near my subjects. I don't care about all this clipping up here, honestly. Um, but some people do, or if that, you know, if that bothers you, you don't want it, you can easily just go right over it like so. Um, I prefer to leave that area up there. Honestly, I, I like a little bit of a, a brighter image. Just like that. It's done and it's easy and it didn't affect the lighting on your subject's faces at all or any of the color tones in the rest of the image. You just selectively uh, changed mostly the baby sweater and around their head. So there's a little bit more definition here than there was before. Thanks so much for watching and I hope you found this tip helpful.